Amazing. I can I can feel the assistance straight away. Hey guys, I'm Nick Besta. I'm a sub 220 marathoner and today I am intrigued by these exoskeletons. This is the Hypershell X Ultra exoskeletons. They're perfect for the course today. Um, these are the world's best exoskeletons to date and uh, I reached out to them and I really wanted to test out a pair and here I am at my local hill, St. Catherine's Hill. Test is I'm gonna go up the hill without them and then go up the hill with them. We'll see whether the heart rate is slightly reduced um, at the same pace or if the heart rate's the same and we're going at a slightly faster uh, pace. They apparently improve your performance by up to around 40% or so. So today let's put them to the test and see if that's the case. After that I might just do a couple of strides in them as well to see what they like for running. Pretty pretty scared to test these out because I'm worried they feel so good that I never want to take them off. Um, but anyways let's get them on, go up the hill and see what they're all about. Okay guys so first up uh, we're going without the exoskeletons. The main thing is, is that I put the same effort into both, about steady, so 4 out of 10 effort. Woo! We made it. Oh, you won't believe it. I forgot to stop my watch. <laughs> Got to do again, buddy. I'm not even joking. Okay, guys, take number two. We just went up and I forgot to hit start on my watch. And as we know, if it's not on Strava, it doesn't count. We go again. Josh, you ready? Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Oh, boy, the hardest part is to not get too dizzy from these steps. I'm really looking forward to the second part with the exoskeletons on. What's the effort again here, Nick? <laughs> Let's go with 5 out of 10. You're breathing quite heavy. My man, getting the heels in. Waking up a bit of a sweat. Heart rate 136. 136. Okay. We've made it. We'll get back down, give it like a two or three minute recovery, just to bring the heart rate down. Let's go. Okay guys, we go again, this time with these beauties on. So the battery just clips in, boom, like that. It's fully charged at the moment. It's got adjustments over here to adjust based on your hips, which I did prior to recording. It then goes around. You've obviously got to clip it in nice and firm over there. This section over here, once again, you can adjust it based on your leg length. I'm slightly longer than the normal person, so we put this down and we clip it in nice and firm this side. Make sure it's nice and tight. I feel like Laura Croft from Tomb Raider. <laughs> uh, okay, so time, time to put these bad boys on. So we'll hold it down over there. As you can see, it's got full battery. So here we're in eco mode. We're gonna go in hyper mode. It's going to go red. There we go. Adjust the hip. We've done that. Buckle up the belt. We've done that. Adjust the legs. We've done that. Buckle up the legs. Boom. Done. Final review. Check, check, check. All is good. Connecting via Bluetooth. Happy days. Congratulations. All is connected. Eco mode. For when you want to go longer. We're not going very long today. That's eco mode and they really feel good. There we go, we're in hyper mode and then... So, what mode should we go with? It's got, uh, got to be hyper it's mode. It's got to right? be hyper, right? <laughs> Full speed. Okay, hyper mode and then let's double tap, double tap, double tap. Full speed, hyper mode. Let's go. Word, I can already feel a difference. Are you ready for the hill, Nick? Are you ready? I'm excited, I'm excited. It's almost like I've had some pre-workouts and I'm ready to go. <laughs> Form ready. I've got the easy part. Josh, my buddy recording, he's got the harder part, that's for sure. Um, as you can see, we're in hyper mode, full strength, ready to go. Three, two, one, let's go. Oh, this feels glorious. <laughs> so first thoughts? Amazing, I can, I can feel the assistance straight away. Um, yeah. Effort is less relative to output. So happy days. They feel great.
<laughs> Come on, let's go. My legs are feeling it, Nick. <laughs> it's like I've got super shoes and you got normal shoes. Yeah. Check 132. 132. Woo! We have made it. Um, yeah, wow. Well, compare stats, I'll get them on screen, but I must say, it's like, I don't know if you can tell from the video, but you can see it, like, it feels like someone pulls your leg forward almost, and yeah, the assistance, it's just awesome. <laughs> um, and it, it took some getting used to right in the beginning. Doesn't necessarily, uh, like mean you're gonna work less hard. It just means you might work a little bit faster for your efforts and you can go a bit further and stuff like that. So I think as time goes on, you'll see these become more and more popular. Um, but yeah, it uses AI, so it works out your movement patterns and it can assist you on the way down as well. So let's see how it feels on the way back down. Okay, so walking away from the challenge and clearly I like this because I'm not taking them off. It feels like, it feels like you're the Hulk, like someone's literally going boof, boof, boof. Okay, so now we're gonna do a 400 meter sort of like easier effort and see what they're like running wise. You ready, Josh? I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> Can you come in? How are they feeling? Yeah, good. Four fourteen, just just over fourteen per k. Let's see what it's like without them. Okay, three, two, one. Let's go. Just over fourteen per k. Okay, boom. We are done. Pretty much same pace. We'll compare heart rates and see. Let's go. Hang on. It doesn't feel as weird. <laughs> ah, wait for me! <laughs> if you do a slight movement, you can feel it really assisting you. I can... <laughs> like, it twitches my leg. It's, it's interesting. Nice. Thanks so much, cool. buddy. Appreciate well, it. Mate. Don't get too comfy. I want them back. I'll take them off if I can. Hey, so what, what are they used for? It's like, it's a good enough boost to feel natural but not too much that it feels like it propels you too much forward. So it goes around your waist yes. and then... Exactly, it goes around like this. Yes, yes. Just in here. You wanna give it a go? Yeah. You wanna give it a go. Yeah. Right. What it's doing is you're still putting in work, so you can go further um, or keep up with, with people if you wanted to. Um, yeah, but you're more than welcome yeah. to, okay. to try it. Okay. Yeah. So Thank we'll you. put it around here. It heavy? Just, just a it's, it's not heavy. So it's 1.8 kilograms. Oh. Nothing. Yeah. No. Yeah. You don't. You don't really notice it. Feel it. <laughs> okay. So walk it a little bit now. Okay. Hang on. It's... Oh, I can feel it. That, really? That's the eco mode. Okay. okay. So, so now we're going to put it on a higher mode. Okay. There we go. Ooh. That's the ultra mode. <laughs> Look at you go. How does it feel? Great. It's lifting. It's lifting you up and making you go. <laughs> hey. I don't run. I this is great. I can't keep up. <laughs> You could it's see why great. it would, yeah. It's lovely. It's amazing, eh? and yeah. I think it's come come a long way in a short space of time. Yeah. In the future, it's, it's only going to increase. This is gonna good, isn't yeah. it? Is it is it helpful for for training? Because it's almost yeah, 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 pushing you to to go that little bit further. Exactly. Yeah. Without the psychology of yeah. oh yeah. So oh. I, I did a test with it. I did a four hundred meter run, and my effort was relatively lower to the yeah. same pace. Yeah. Anyone else want to try? You guys all good? You want to go? On, give it a go. Cool. <laughs> There we go. It was a facilitation uh -huh. rather than uh, anything aggressive or forceful. It was, yeah, it's, it's, it's intelligent. It's surprisingly um, good. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you said your name's David. Yes. Okay, let's just see. So just, there we go. Okay. Yes. You can walk away. Yep. Yes. So walk in, see if it picks up. There we go. How does it feel, David? No. Oh. He's not going to stop now. 
the hard part is taking them off because once you run okay. with them, yeah. <laughs> you get used to them. Yeah. There you go. And how long does yeah. the battery last for? Uh, the battery lasts, so this is on full power, so it lasts six hours. Six on hours. on okay. eco mode, it lasts 30 okay. hours, yeah. so it depends on how much is this. Well, David, Great. David, we're on a sponsored walk on, at the moment. Here we go. <laughs> and you've just done a sponsored run. For say aphasia. Thank you guys so much, appreciate it. All the no, best. Thanks so much for your time. Awesome. And uh, cool. I'll see you around on park run and stuff like that. So I'll probably bump into you again. Amazing. Thanks I'll see you at so park much. run. Cool. Thank you guys so much. Okay. Cheers, Cheers, guys. Best, bye. Thank bye. you. Wow. What an amazing group of people to bump into. So apart from the running and hiking side, you can use it for cycling too. He has me testing it out on my bike. And I must say, once you get into the rhythm of things, you really feel that performance boost of it. Struggling to keep up with your mates in a group cycle? No problem. Get yourself a pair of these bad boys. So in summary, I was really impressed with this exercise skeleton. Just to remind you, it's a wearable that you can strap to your body and adjust it so that it's a nice and comfy fit tailored to you. It extends your physical capabilities so you can go faster and further than before relative to the same efforts. For many people, the thought might be, isn't this cheating or I really don't need it? But just imagine this. You're traveling and you're just too exhausted to visit that one place that you truly wanted to see. Or you're on a hike and your legs give up before you've reached the summit. An exoskeleton doesn't replace your efforts. It simply saves your energy so you can use it where it truly matters. To reach that view you came for or to go further than fatigue would normally allow. What if that next peak wasn't a question of if, but just part of the plan? With Hypershell, distance no longer limits your curiosity. It fuels it.